Hello friends, it's Kathy Clement with Kathy by Design for Really Reasonable Ribbon. I'm here to share my project for the Really Reasonable Ribbon April 2024 blog hop. This is a monthly hop that we do on the 13th of every month. You get to see what all the Really Reasonable Ribbon designers have cooked up to inspire you. And there's even a prize package. Just for hopping and leaving a comment, you could win a $10 gift card to Really Reasonable Ribbon, as well as the digital stamp set of your choice. So it's well worth hopping and seeing what's going on at Really Reasonable Ribbon. My project is this adorable little box that I built and decorated up with this Robin's Egg Blue textured ribbon that you can get at Really Reasonable Ribbon. I've also added some of their beautiful mulberry flowers to go with our flowers or Mother's Day theme. These are the white magnolias, these are peonies, and these are the little sweetheart blossoms and the mixed pastel. I've got some iridescent uh, metallic string that I've tucked into my little bow cluster to add some extra sparkle and shine. The paper collection I'm working with is Stamparia's gorgeous brocante and um, I've shared quite a few projects with this. I love this collection and it just seemed perfect for this Mother's Day flower themed hop. So the base of my box is made with a Graphic 45 large craft tag. I simply scored the tag and then I added sides with more craft paper and glued it together and it made this sweet little box. I've added little box feet that I brushed up with a little metal wax to give them some patina. The back is also covered with my designer papers. I used the Graphic 45 large tag die to cut out my papers. I've threaded this beautiful textured ribbon through the top along with metallic iridescent string and another one of these pretty magnolias. So this is super cute to set out on a desk or a side table in a baby's room. It would be really sweet. You could tuck a little gift card in there for mom and you'd have a super gift. I'll show you what's inside the box as I take these out. But I'm just gonna show you, when I scored this, I just took my tag and from the domed top, you're going to score at four and a half, and then you're going to fold there and score again at one and a half, and that creates the box. The sides are two and a half inches by two and a quarter inches, and I scored little half inch flaps on each side and this, then just glued them inside the box to, to form the shape, and then put your little feet on and you're good to go. It's a really fun little project and it could be adapted for any theme. Inside the box, I've put these darling little mini folios. The base for these little tags is heavy cardstock. I've used this same kind of robin's egg blue to match my ribbon. And I took a 10 inch by three and a half inch piece of my cardstock and then I scored it at three and a half and three and a half. And then this last flap is only three and a quarter inches. And then you just line it with your designer papers. This page, this little flap page, I just cut it a little extra wide. I cut it at four and three quarters and scored it to make my flap. Here's a little belly band with a tag inside it. This is a little sentiment that I journaled on my computer. And so you've got room in here, you could put little photos, you could tuck in a little gift card, or just keep it like a sweet little folio. They're so cute to look at. So that's the first one. The second one has this sweet bird and teacup and the same format. I've just added a little teacup to my flap. Here's my sentiment here. And my tag is in this pocket. I folded it so it would fit. This next tag has a really sweet sewing theme with this vintage sewing machine. These are the washi tape images from the Brocante collection that I've decorated the cover with and then some little vintage buttons from my stash. Here's our little flip page. 
Here's our tag in a pocket. And here's our little sentiment. So fun, a fun little gift to give. Even if you don't add anything to it, it's pretty perfect just as it is. It's just like a, having a series of little lap books to enjoy. And this tag is behind this belly band. So that is my project for the Really Reasonable Ribbon April 2024 blog hop. I will put a link to my blog in the description box below this video and I will have links to the supplies that I used here so that if you want to make this box you can make one of your own. It's really not hard. It's just a tag that you score and fold and glue together. So make sure you go buy the Really Reasonable Ribbon blog and answer Bonnie's question of the month so you can be entered in that drawing for the free ribbon and the free digital stamp set. Thank you so much for joining me, Kathy Clement, Kathy by Design. Go get your craft on. Bye.